In this screencast, we're going to take a look at the ASPX Combo Box's new property, Filter Minimum Length, or Filter Min Length to be exact. And this property allows you to specify a minimum set of characters before filtering operations start on the ASPX Combo Box. Now, to see why that's important, let's first take a look at this ASPX Combo Box that's bound to a very large data source. Now here, the ASPX combo box is bound to a large amount of data. And if I start typing in some characters like A, L, I'll see that immediately the ASPX combo box is looking for all records that contain those two characters. So here it finds it in Michael, here it finds it in Alexander. And if I keep typing to specify further, if I put in an E, you'll see that filtering keeps going on. And it happens every time I type in a character. Now what's happening here is that the ASPX combo box is deferring getting all these records to the database. Now this is a great feature because it allows you to only fetch a certain amount of records and keep it light and fast. However, if we don't want to keep hitting the database for every time the user presses a key, for example D, it's going to find all the records that contain the letter D in it. And we instead we want to say, well let's at least specify two or three characters that the user has to input before they can start searching for those records, well, the filter minimum length property lets us do that. So, let's go ahead and set that in the ASPX combo box. So, I'll go to the ASPX combo box, and if I scroll up to the behavior category, I'll find the filter min length property. Now, I'll set this to the number of characters I want the user to enter before it starts filtering. So, I'll put in three characters, and let's take a look at this in action. Now, we can see the ASPX combo box, if I start typing in some letters like DA, you'll see that it's not actually filtering. Now, if I hit the last character, it's going to then meet the requirement for the filter mint length property and begin its operations. And now I can keep going on and type in more characters and it's going to still keep and sorting those. Thanks for watching.